Welcome to this KD Tips and Tricks screencast. This time I want to show you how you can configure your panel to your liking. First of all, as you can see, I have a normal panel, just like the one that ships in the default installation of KDE, basically. So I have my tray icon here, my tray icons, my, my clock, my, my shutdown or leave button, I have my workspace switcher, I have my activities button, and I have my kick off menu button. And what I want to add is just quick launch items, just like for example for my web browser and my mail client. What I have to do is just go into the menu and I have the option here to right click on the item that I want to add to the panel and choose add to panel. This will add an icon to the panel. As you can see here, the Chromium icon was added to the panel, but it was added to the far right. So to move this icon, I can click on this little cashew which allows me to basically configure the different widgets or plasmoids inside the panel. So if I hover over this icon, you can see that there, there you get a little overlay here, which allows you to either delete the icon or to configure the icon. And if you go with the mouse over the icon itself, you have the option to move the icon. So let me just move it to the far left. And if this little grayish rectangle pops up, you can then just let go and it will stick to this rectangle, just like this. And now I have added a quick launch item. But this can be a little bit nasty, especially if you are configuring uh, lots and lots of quick launch items. Um, just adding them manually is, uh, is not a very good option especially if you're moving them or if you want to change the panels so uh, sometimes it can be very handy to have a group which contains all of those quick launch items and therefore KDE ships with a quick launch plasmoid which you can just simply add to your panel so just click so let me just remove this uh, Chromium web browser I have other either the option to to just click on this cashew and then uh, on this pop-up I can just click the X button to remove it or I can just right click it and say remove this icon and this will remove the icon. What I can now do is just add some widgets and this is a cool feature because I can add lots and lots of stuff, lots and lots of widgets, almost basically every widget that I have on my that I can store on my desktop I can also store in my panel just like for example the bookmarks here, just let me drag it in here show you how it looks like it's just it's, it's just an icon but if I close this if I click on it it normally should <laughs>